And now, your Stormwatch 4 weather forecast on WOAY. Good evening, folks. Happy Tuesday to you. We're tracking rain on this Tuesday evening. We will continue to do so for the next couple of days as well. Let's take a little bit of a closer look at where we are currently seeing rain. Folks out there near Idre and Pocahontas County and northern Greenbrier County are seeing some light rain. Even folks in Lewisburg are likely seeing some rain moving into the area right now. We also have rain impacting folks out there in Monroe County just to the east of Union about the rest of us for Oak Hill, Beckley, down into Bluefield are dry as of now. Most of Tazewell County is dry with the exception of the extreme southernmost parts, but don't worry if you aren't seeing rain right now, we will have more chances for rain over the next couple of hours. Here's a look at 8.30 tonight, seeing some scattered shower activity across most of our counties. Not going to be a complete washout. I do believe the first half of the day was definitely our best chance of rain for the next couple of days, but we're still going to be tracking some. Don't worry, I do expect you to see a couple more drops at your house. Midnight tonight, looking at dry conditions, but as we move into the early morning hours tomorrow, we'll start to see more rain activity across Appalachia. This is 7 o'clock seeing scattered showers moving on in and we'll have more of the same throughout the day tomorrow. Slightly less shower coverage than perhaps what we've seen so far today but overall everyone's going to have a shot at seeing rain tomorrow. We could even get a couple heavier pockets of rain as well for any of our counties. Anyone has a chance at seeing light to even moderate rain throughout the day tomorrow. Looks like we will dry out a bit for your Thursday late at night before we have, or rather Wednesday late at night before we head into Thursday morning. We're going to continue to see rainfall totals amount anywhere from just a tenth of an inch to possibly up to a, a five tenths of an inch for folks in Oak Hill through tomorrow night. Even folks up in Pocahontas County, the best chance of rain will could see amounts up to an or eight tenths of an inch. So we're looking good for some locations, especially the further east you get, you'll definitely see more rain. The further west you get, it's likely you'll see slightly lower amounts. What about our fire weather? We've been talking about it for a while now. We're looking at a low risk tomorrow, but this is going to change as we start to head into the weekend. We're going to have nice humidity levels, nice I mean by seeing rain over the next couple of days, but by Friday, Saturday into Sunday our humidity levels will drop again, temperatures are going to heat up again, and that means conditions will be prime for fire weather. You'll definitely have to be careful as you head into the weekend. Aches and pains forecast, honestly not too much change in the pressure. You might not notice it. This one sponsored by ARH, more for Appalachia. As we head into the day tomorrow, temperatures will be in the upper 60s, low 70s for all of southern West Virginia. Off and on showers expected for your Wednesday. We'll keep slightly lower rain chances in through Thursday as well. Friday we're going to dry out, Saturday and Sunday a higher risk for fire weather. And as we head into next week, there is a small chance of rain returning to the region. <laughs>